Hello everybody, welcome to the stream. Tonight we're going to be playing a little bit of Nintendo World Championship NES Edition. Uh, if you're not familiar what uh, the Nintendo World Championship game is, uh, it's essentially taking the Nintendo World Championships and bringing it to your living room. Um, in this game, we have 13 uh, of the most memorable, I guess, uh, NES games. Uh, over 150 speed running challenges. Uh, you can take on challenges with up to seven other players uh, in local party mode. So up to eight players total in the living room. You can play online with uh, some of the best. Let's see here. Uh, if you're able to get the deluxe set, which I have seen some uh, around town, and some stores uh, you get what's included in the box you get the NES uh, or the Nintendo World Championship NES game card physical of course you get a gold colored replica NES cartridge and a stand to uh, commemorate it the Nintendo uh, the 1999 1990 World Championships 13 art cards and a set of five pins Check your local retailer for availability. Uh, if you can't find that and you still want to play the game, you're definitely able to pick it up digitally. Um, if you go on the eShop, it's available for $29.99. Uh, in store, if you can find the physical uh, version, it's $59.99. Definitely, uh, the physical version is really worthwhile getting. So with that being said, we are going to go ahead and start here. I just, what we're gonna end up doing is we're gonna play some speed run uh, mode and we're gonna pick one of the games. I think I'm gonna go ahead and pick Donkey Kong. Um, we're gonna go through, we're gonna unlock uh, some of the challenges and they will be increasing in difficulty uh, as we go through. Um, and then when we get done with the the, the final challenge, uh, we'll end the stream there. So sit back, relax. Uh, if you've played this game before, feel free to uh, provide some help um, in the form of backseating. Uh, it is definitely encouraged. Uh, there's some challenges I may not know. Uh, I know we played the game uh, a few days ago and uh, had some trouble with uh, Kirby. So. If you have some pointers, let me know. Uh, one of the things that I didn't realize last time is as I was playing, I realized, uh, or after I was playing, I realized that my cam was in the way of most of the challenges. So I will switch over to the full gameplay screen. That way I'm not in the way and uh, pop up every once in a while if, if need be. So this first challenge, is going or is called bottom rung. Uh, we're just going to climb a ladder and uh, we just need to try to do it as fast as possible. We're going to aim for S rank uh, if at all possible. And if we have some trouble like we did with Kirby, we'll definitely just uh, take what we can get if it's too difficult. So, with that being said, let's go ahead and start our first challenge. Um, as far as I know, there's really nothing to it as far as that challenge goes uh you literally just start running to the right and, and climb uh which it looks like we were able to to get a s rank score and we got a pin uh one of the things that i like i mentioned if you are playing or if you end up getting the physical version in stores you get uh, a set of pins uh from the game um some of them will look exactly like this. Uh, I can't remember which ones. I think it, I wanna say it's five of the pins that you get in game, um, but definitely worth worth getting. So we set a personal best of 4.88 seconds. Hey Riker, thanks for jumping on the stream. Uh, I see you in the chat. I hope uh, you're having a good evening. I am not coming over tonight, at least not right now, but maybe I can later. Uh, or definitely tomorrow since it's Friday. I know, I know, very sad. 
Uh, but feel free to uh, to hang out with me while I play a little bit of this game. All right, so the next challenge that we're going to be doing, or, well, we have to unlock it. It's going to be the normal challenge for this game, uh, Hammer Hustle. One of the things that you'll notice when you're playing this game is you'll get a demo. Uh, if you need to speed it up, you can just by holding down the plus button. Uh, but essentially, it shows you the objective uh, of the of the challenge. Uh, this difficulty is normal, so it's super, super simple. Um, hey, Riker, it's not that I'm not coming over much. It's just that um, I was gonna I was gonna hang out and test out my streaming. Uh, so that's what I'm doing. Uh, I'll, like I said, I'll be there tomorrow. Then we'll hang out, play some games, maybe do some streaming on your channel. Uh, by the way, guys, uh, if you haven't already, uh, you should definitely check out Riker's channel. Uh, his channel is called Riker One Two Three Four Case O Brother. I know it's a mouthful, but you should definitely check it out. Uh, okay, so we're gonna go ahead and try this challenge. It looks like the only thing we need to do in this one is grab the hammer as fast as possible. Uh, again, we can just check out the, the demo. He grabs it and the challenge is over. <laughs> no, Riker, I'm not gonna stream on your channel. You're gonna stream on your channel. I'm just gonna be there to help you. I'll be like your producer. I'll make sure that we can uh, switch through different scenes and everything. It'll be cool. All right, here we go, guys. All right, so right off the bat, we're just gonna run, run, run as fast as we can, climb up and just book it. I'm going to go ahead and go to the last rung, or the ladder. And just like that, we got our S rank. Uh, and we also unlocked a pin. Uh, earn an A rank or higher in the, in the challenge to get it. All right, so we got S on that one. And we're just going to keep unlocking. The next one is going to be Barrel Road. And this Barrel Roll, and this one is actually a hard difficulty. Uh, it looks like we just need to reach Pauline, uh, the princess up there at the top, without getting hit as fast as possible. Uh, a little bit more difficult be uh, because we're going further into the, the stage and trying to uh, not get hit. Trying to uh, dodge all the barrels coming down at us. And with that, let's go ahead and get it done. So again, we're just trying to get through the challenge as fast as possible. We're going to run up the ladders, hopefully avoid getting hit, uh, dodge obstacles. I think so far so good. I, I think we can actually keep some of the barrels from getting on top of us if we stay at the very top of the ladder. All right, we did get an A+. Plus. Uh, I, I, so Riker, he's, he's right. We should try to get an S on every, uh, every challenge. So, uh, with an A plus, I think we can do better. I, I kind of stopped on one of the ladders for a second. So let's see if we can shave down a couple of seconds. I know A plus plus is a possibility. So I'm not sure how many seconds we need to shave off. All right. Oh no, I, I lost some precious seconds on that one. And I got hit. Um, so with that being, with that happening, we're just gonna reset the entire stage because uh, those precious seconds do add up and we definitely want to try to get an S rank. Uh, here we go, we're giving it another shot, trying to avoid any, ah, I need to hit the jump button. We're gonna start that over. Why I'm hitting I'm hitting the right arrow. What's going on here? Okay, let's give this a try again. Again, those precious seconds. I had my finger on the right button this time, so we can jump over these barrels. And is this an S rank? Uh, it is an A plus plus. What do you think, Riker? Should we give it one more chance to try to get an A, or should we just be happy with the A++? I'll, I'll let you uh, kind of pick. 
Nah, be okay with the A++. I think so too. Uh, with that being said, let's go ahead and go on to the next one. Um, this one is also a hard challenge. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm reading Riker's uh, messages in the chat. Well, I am so sorry, Riker, but I mean, if I headed over to your house now, you wouldn't get very much time to hang out with me before you had to go to bed. It is a school night after all. So, uh, we can definitely plan on Sunday evening for sure. I think that's going to be a good idea. We'll, we'll have to definitely plan for Sunday evening. We'll get the streaming equipment set up uh, and we'll get you streaming on your channel. Again, if you guys haven't already, check out Riker's channel. Uh, you can go to uh, his channel by clicking on his username and uh, checking out some of his previous streams. Um, and we're, we're trying to get him set up. So if, if you guys can, go ahead and show him some love over on his channel. The next challenge, challenge that we unlocked is Lost and Found. This one is also a hard difficulty. Uh, it looks like we're moving on to the next uh, stage in the Donkey Kong game. Uh, Watching, watching you play Ultra Kill Wreckers is pretty cool too. So, All right, so if you want to check out the objective, it's to collect the parasol and purse. Uh, so you'll see those pink items on the stage. Uh, and we are watching the demo of it. Um, and it looks pretty straightforward. We just want to grab those two items, uh, again, as quickly as possible, trying to shave off as many seconds as we can. So without further ado, I'll, I'll stop talking and we'll get, we'll get going. Again, I don't want to stream all night. We just want to stream long enough to get all the challenges completed. Oh, my dear lord. Ah. Okay. Um, again, we want to shave off as many seconds as we can. So we're going to go ahead and just restart that one. I know, right? right? Okay, jump, jump. <clears throat> so what did we do wrong this time? Or... From the last time because we were able to to get up the ladders without worrying about that little fire guy okay so he's gone all right that is going to get us an a plus uh and we do get to go ahead and unlock the pin uh do we want to try Riker? what do you think <laughs> Do we want to go ahead and try for the S rank, or is A plus going to be good enough for us? No. Okay. Okay. Let's just try to get through these as quickly as possible. Then. Uh, so our next challenge is going to actually be a master uh, difficulty, uh, and this one is Reach Paulina. So it looks like we're just going to uh, get through the entire stage itself. So if we want to watch the demo, it's, it's, it seems like it's pretty uh, self-explanatory. Uh, we're not or they're not going for any of the uh, items in the game, so uh, we probably won't either. So with that being said, let's go ahead and start this one. Oh, <coughs> he did jump across and just kind of skip a lot of that. Okay, so. Ah, okay, we're gonna start that challenge over. I think what we're gonna do this time is just jump onto this platform, let it take us, because it's, I think a little bit faster. And that was apparently not the right thing to do. So we'll do this again. We'll jump across the bottom one. And apparently that was wrong as well. <clears throat> so I have not played this game in a long time uh, since I was a little kid. So you're gonna have to give me a, a bit of a break. Okay, and we're gonna continue on here. It looks like if we back up just a little bit, we can let that bounce pad bounce right over us. So that way we can avoid getting hit. All right, here we go. So it looks like this is the spot. As soon as it passes over, we'll go. A++ is good enough for me. We'll go ahead and move on to the next one. Uh, this one is also a master difficulty challenge. Um, so this one's called Finders Keepers. We're gonna collect the parasol and the purse again. And it looks like we have to collect both parasols. 
Uh, so in, in this game, it looks like once you walk over those little yellow boxes, uh, they disappear. Um, I think the ultimate objective when we get to the next challenge is that we want to clear out those little boxes and allow all the beams to fall down and, and take out Donkey Kong. So um, since we don't need to worry about that just yet, we're just gonna try to get up there as fast as possible. Climb, climb, climb. I don't know if it would be better to climb up all the way to the right and then to the left, or if what we're doing is fine. All right, A plus plus. So there's got to be a, a, a better, there's got to be a better route to take. Uh, but that did a, that did net us the pin for that. Uh, and it looks like we have two more challenges. This one's also a master challenge difficulty, a master, a master difficulty challenge. And I just realized I don't have any more coins. Uh, I, I guess we have to. Play. Do we? Do we get coins from playing previous challenges? Well, let's find out real quick. All we have to do is climb the ladder on this one, so it's gonna be super easy. Uh, let's see if we can beat our challenge, or beat our time, which we did. Uh, and it looks like it did give us some more coins. Uh, and and I, we actually got enough to unlock that challenge. So let's back out. We'll unlock the 100 coin challenge. And then the legend's gonna be 300 coins. We're down to seven. So we're gonna try to figure out uh, what we need to do to get 300 coins in, in this stream. Um, looks like we're gonna, okay, so those yellow boxes are bolts. So we're gonna need to pull out all the bolts. So I was correct. Uh, see, I do remember a little bit about playing this game back in the day. Uh, looks like we've got some enemies to jump over. Some, it looks like they're trying to take out, ah, I see what they're doing. Maybe there's a way to plan out the route. But so far, uh, we're just gonna try to do what he did uh, and try to get the time that we need to get at least an A plus or higher. Ah, already right off the bat, I think we did that kind of wrong. So let's go ahead and reset. We're gonna go left, so that way we can just go straight across both of these bolts them out and move on up to the next level. So these all seem relatively easy to get. Uh, but then there is that last bolt up on top. What in the world? I don't know if points matter, Riker, but... Uh, <laughs> I certainly don't want to get hit by these guys. Ah! Okay, we're gonna restart because again, um, while points don't necessarily matter, uh, the time does. So we're gonna start over and just get. Hmm. Okay. I, I was I was seeing if there was a way to just go back and get that one bolt. So we're just gonna go ahead and do what we were doing originally. If we see a better route as we're going, we'll, we'll try to remember it and take that. Alright, so he went up, and I think he got this bolt, which we're not going to be able to get. Ah! So difficult. When you just want to try to get through as fast as possible. Otherwise, I mean, if we had the time, what we would probably do is get the hammer and just start knocking out some of the enemies. And then grab uh, all the items, like the purse and the umbrella, parasol. Okay. Uh, you should have seen me yesterday, Riker, with uh, the Kirby challenges. I was starting to get frustrated uh, with a couple of the master ones, I think. And you know, it was just horrible. I didn't want to play anymore. Okay, so it looks like we have an opportunity to grab that bolt. And we'll just jump over that. Ah, see, when these guys stay out of the way, we do a little bit better. We did lose some seconds on that last bolt, uh, but we did get an A++. 
Uh, so the legend challenge, I, if I'm not mistaken, I think it's essentially doing all those three stages as fast as possible. Again, uh, for the speed run challenges, we don't really care about points uh, unless unless you're going for a high score speed challenge. Then you want to try to get as many points as possible in the short amount of, short shortest amount of time. Um, so we are running into an issue where we need coins. So we can do a couple of things. We can try to, to speed up our times on a couple of these shorter challenges. And uh, it looks like we just matched the time on that. I'm, I'm wondering if that's all we're gonna be able to do is match our time. So we'll just run through some of these easier challenges. We're gonna go for a, a higher, or a, a lesser time. Didn't that count? We didn't we touch the hammer? I, we can't. We I don't think we can jump off the half ladder. Or see, we got it. Ah, I don't know what the deal is. Like I'm touching the hammer. You you saw me. We were robbed, and of course, I'm having troubles now. Now that we're trying to get. scores wow even just point 20 seconds uh, doesn't allow us to get an, an s rank so uh, like I said even down to the fraction of a second matters um, so Riker's asking if climbing up a half rung of ladder is gonna matter so we'll give it a try see Told ya. I've been alive a little longer than you have, Riker, so I've played this game uh, more. <laughs> so what if we climb that middle ladder? Will that give us a shorter amount of time? I wonder if that would have worked. For whatever reason, we're not touching the, the hammer. Um, Maybe just jumping straight up instead of jumping and to the left. Okay, so we're just gonna stop there. Yeah, I, I don't think that middle ladder is a little bit faster. Try to jump onto the top half. We can't, like there is no jump. Um, I'll show you. Jump, jump, jump. I'm pushing the jump button. I don't know if you can tell in that lower left-hand corner of the screen uh, next to my username. It shows it, it shows it what buttons you're pushing, so. Okay, so let's move on to, we're at 82 coins. Uh, maybe we can get an S on this one. Um, so reach Pauline, we just need to get to the top as fast as possible. Again, avoiding obstacles. Maybe we can shave off a second. I wish there was a run button to move us a little bit quicker. I know, I'm straight dog water. get our S rank and we got 30 coins for that plus five to get a new for or get an a new personal best uh, we don't need to play that again we're at 117 uh, we have a couple of other ones that are a plus and higher but not S rank so we could definitely try to <laughs> to get this yes I know what it is <laughs> well so my goal is to try to get this challenge just these challenges done before Riker has to get off so because then we'll end the stream about that time as well. Ah. And if we can't get it before Riker has to go, maybe we can uh, try to get it before Riker finishes that. 
last rank. There we go. We have another 30 point or coins and five additional on top of that. So we're at 152. And we're getting our S ranks. So What is this one? Um, oh, Reach Pauline. So that's what we got to do on this one. Oh, this is the one where we could jump, I think. On the... Okay. Let's see if we can catch it right on this one. I kind of forgot what we did last time. Just get past that fire. Ah, it's too big of a jump. Can we just jump on this one? Or is this gonna be? I think it'd be better if we get all the way to the top, right? So, because we got an S rank in Master uh, difficulty, it gave us 60 coins um, plus 5, so we're at 217. Uh, looks like we have two more challenges that are sitting at A++. We're going to try to, to shave off those, those seconds, and even fractions of seconds, uh, to try to get to try to get all of our coins that we need. So, I feel like I feel like if we went all the way to the right, instead of climbing up that one, grabbing the uh, parasol on the far right, then moving all the way to the left, and then grabbing that far left parasol at the top, I think that might give us a little bit better of a time. So we're gonna go ahead and try that, and just try to shave off as many of those seconds as we can. Uh, this way we don't have to walk backwards, we're just literally walking to the left and then going up. That should give us... Right there. A++. Uh, we didn't get our S rank. What was our original time? Okay, so we, we shaved off point three or eight zero seconds. Um, but we did get some more coins. Um, I want to try to get... I want to try to get as many coins as we can before Riker has to get off. Okay, so we're just going to try to move this quickly, and I can already tell you that we messed up. For whatever reason, my controller didn't let me go left. You can, you can see all my inputs on the bottom left. You can see the controller down there and see which buttons I'm pushing. I was pushing left, but for whatever reason, I got stuck. I can't remember what the challenge was. <laughs> what, what are we doing here? Pull all the bolts. That's what I thought. Okay, let's go back. You got to know what you're doing. You got to have a clear definition of like what you're supposed to be doing before you take it on. I, uh, I should have did better and paid attention. Alright, so we're moving, moving, moving. Ah. We're already just slightly behind. These little fire guys. What in the world? Alright, Riker, thanks for joining. I try to give myself an extra challenge on top of getting all these challenges done by trying to get before you had to go and take a bath. But if you can, come back when you're done. If not, we'll talk to you Sunday. So far, I think we're doing okay. I just need to avoid those little fire guys. He needs to get out of here. Okay, 
and I don't think we're going to get a faster time than we did originally. Uh, but we did get 30 coins. Um, I think as long as we get an A rank in these master ones, it should be fine. What was this one again? Reach following. 14 seconds, 17 seconds, 31 seconds. So, if we're just gonna go for coins, we just need 20 more. Maybe we'll just do the hard one. Uh, so this is 21 seconds versus 12 seconds. This will probably be the fastest one. Uh, let's just try to get an A, and that should give us hopefully 20 coins. I'm not sure what the coin reward would be on this one. That should give us an A. Okay, so we got 15. We literally just need to do that one more time. And we'll have that. This point, I just need to get that A. And that was a B, but we hit 300. So let's go ahead and take that, get out of there. We can unlock our legend difficulty challenge Kong Crusher, clear level one through three. Um, as you're playing along, uh, you get these classified information things. Um, it's just little snippets uh, from, I want to say, the instruction booklets um, or just uh, some pointers um, that, that I guess you could get through the Nintendo hotline, possibly. Uh, let's see. Let sleeping hammers lie. You can break barrels with the hammer, but you can't climb ladders while holding it. You're better off not touching it. Again, if, if we're trying to do these challenges as fast as possible... We're going to avoid power-ups. We're going to avoid uh, getting uh, points. And we're just going to try to climb up as fast as we can. It, it looks like it gives us the optimal route for this uh, particular level. Um, Mario doesn't need to be at a ladder center to start climbing. That's a good thing to know. He can grab it if he's off center. So start climbing as soon as possible to save some time. Uh, let's see the ladder the six ladders to success only climb the ladders along the shortest route reaching the top uh, Will take a lot longer if you climb unnecessary ladders um, and for the last one save your jumping for leap days You'll need to jump to avoid barrels, but you'll lose time when you land keep your keep jumping to a minimum So those are all great pointers. Uh, let's see what the second uh, page has to offer That looks like it's giving us some pointers on the second level uh, be afraid of heights. Uh, falling from a height that's higher than Mario is tall will end badly. Uh, so we did run into that issue before. And, and it looks like they do give us uh, optimal routes, uh, jumping on these platforms, going up. Again, those little fireball guys, they're going to kind of dictate which route we take. But hey, if we can take the optimal route and avoid them, then that's exactly what we'll need to do. Uh, don't get whacked by the jacks. Uh, yeah, don't get squished by them. And then just pay attention to uh, where you can uh, safely stand and let them bounce over you. Uh, all right, I'm just kind of studying this route, seeing if we can try to take that. And it looks like climbing might be a little bit faster than taking the uh, the uh, whatever those things are called. The little elevators. Okay. And then the last page, uh, grab the bolt, then bolts. So looks like that pout, that route that we took was the optimal route. Uh, avoiding the uh, fire guys. All right, you can pull the bolt in any order, but every second counts. This route will give you the fastest. 
Uh, leap day has arrived. You'll want to jump over the fireballs that get in your way. Uh, just before you touch and press the arrows and jump. Timing your distance. Timing and distance are key. All right, with that information, we can go ahead and give this challenge a go. Um, we did fairly well on most of them. We got S's on all, but I want to say two. Again, we'll just take the optimal route. Um, already we're not up to the best time because we're installed out on the ladders. It looks like we're slowly making up for this time. We should get a good time there. I don't know. Okay, so far so good. Oh, we weren't... <laughs> oh, I shouldn't have restarted from the complete beginning, but uh, we'll give that a try. Um, and go, give it a go again, so... Ugh, that was not nice. Just have to keep that. This is not the optimal route. See, I I really want to start over from the beginning because we're trying to go for that S rank. Well, I guess we don't necessarily need to go for S rank. All right, here's what we'll do. We'll try to pass it, regardless of what time we get or what score we get. Uh, just so that way we can say we beat it, and then if we need to, we can improve our time at a later date. <sighs> Already I was messing up. My inputs aren't necessarily the cleanest for some reason. Because that fired guy was scaring me. Can you jump that far? Uh. Okay, so we were able to do that. Oh wait, we don't want to do that. We want to go here. Stand there. Not exactly the best time. Um, and then this, we just need to clear out the bolts as fast as possible. We've done this, so we know we can uh, get through this. Ah! This guy needs to get out of my way. I don't like him. And of course he comes down. I don't care. I don't care. We just need to be done with it. Lost some time. But there we go. B plus. It wasn't what I wanted. But we did pass it. Uh, Alright guys. With that... That's pretty much it. Uh, I appreciate you guys hanging out, playing. Um, it definitely was uh, fun trying to unlock some of these challenges. Uh, we'll, we'll continuously come back and play more until we have the whole game opened and unlocked. Um, but you guys saw some of my times. If you guys want to uh, take your shot at beating those times or uh, placing your times on the online leaderboards you can definitely pick up this game again you can pick it up digitally you can pick it up physically there's still some physical games out uh, on the store shelves uh, $29.99 for digital uh, $59.99 uh, for physical and you get that sweet 
collector uh, gold colored replica cartridge. Um, I think it's definitely worth it. I have uh, one sitting off to the side over there and I think you would like it. With that being said, thank you guys for coming. Uh, we'll see you next stream.